owe you a little black bag video. I have owed you a little black video. Little black bag. I have owed you a little black bit. I can't even say it. Hello, my friends. I have not done a little black bag video in a very long time, so I've got some stuff to show you. I went to Little Black Bag and I opened up a bag and I ended up with a bunch of stuff that I didn't like. I gifted some of the stuff to myself so that I could trade it at a later date. I'm going to show you what I ended up keeping from that first bag and then what I ended up using the remaining items for so that I could trade to get more stuff, if you know what I mean. So this is kind of like two bags in one. I don't know if that makes sense. If you don't know um, about Little Black Bag or how it works, I'm gonna link some of my older videos below um, so you can kind of get a little bit better idea of what it is, how it all works, and um, you can always go to littleblackbag.com. I will put my referral link down below in case you are interested in that. They have a frequently asked questions section on the Little Black Bag website, so you can go there and find out more information if you need to. So let me show you what I got in my first Little Black Bag. I paid like $40 for each bag, give or take a dollar or two, including shipping. So um, all together, all of this cost me $80 total. So the first thing that I, I got shipped to me from my first bag was these earrings. And if you have seen my Little Black Bag videos before, you know I love these Philippe Threader earrings. They are so stinking cute. They go, you know, isn't that creepy? Um, I have some rose gold ones and I really wanted um, the silver ones. So I got these and I love them. I think they're so cute because I can wear them dressy, casual. They're awesome. Okay, the second thing I got sent to me was this um, bracelet and I just love this. So this bracelet is so stinking cute. And this is the back and how it opens is it opens behind the flower there and I'll show you kind of the size. I can slip it on um, and it kind of hangs there. So it's a little tiny bit big for me, but I really, really like this bracelet. I get so many compliments on it when I wear it. Um, it's just, it's perfect. It's totally my style and I just adore this bracelet. Okay, the other thing that I got shipped to me in that first bag was um, a sample of That Gal um, Brightening Face Primer by Benefit. And I like this. Um, I don't really see much difference um, than the professional. Um, I don't have really big pores, so I don't really see that pore difference with the professional. But as far as makeup staying power, this stuff is really nice. I'll show you. It comes out like a pink. And let me swatch it so you can see how it blends. Um, and it's, I mean, it's a little illuminating, but it's not, like, crazy. Um, and honestly, once I put my foundation and my powder over it, like, it doesn't even, there's really no difference. I mean, it's a nice primer, but I wouldn't buy it personally for the brightening aspect of it. I don't, I think that's kind of bunk. So then I had a bunch of stuff that I just, it's not that I didn't want it, I this stuff was okay, it just, I wasn't crazy about it, so I figured I would gift it to myself, which cost six extra dollars, which I wasn't, didn't really know that. I thought I was just paying for the shipping on the next bag, but that didn't really happen that way. It cost an extra six dollars to gift things to yourself to trade at a later date. And then I ended up with two pairs of shoes and a bag. Okay, because Little Black Bag had a really, really awesome promotion, if you bought a pair of shoes, you got a bag with it. Um, I ended up trading that bag away for a different pair of shoes and then pairing the other pair of shoes with some jewelry items in order to get my bag. So that's kind of how that all worked out. So the shoes are both the same. I got these studded um, ballet slippers, which, oh my gosh, I'm so in love with these things. I got them in a, um, like a ballet pink, and then I got them in the um, pewter color. And I love these things. They are by Wanted. And my, oh, my biggest complaint about these is it took about three times wearing them for them not to hurt my feet. Um, I had to wear band-aids in the back of my heels um, so that they didn't rub here. I was expecting them not to be so stiff and firm. I was expecting them to be softer. Um, I have some ballet flats that are nice and soft, but these are very um, structured. So just be aware of that um, and that they, they may need some breaking in for you to enjoy wearing them. Um, these are a seven and a half. I usually float between a seven and a seven and a half, and these fit me perfectly. I'm so glad I didn't get the seven. The seven would have been way too small. So I really, really like these shoes. Yay, shoes! And I really was gonna, I was gonna get ballet flats anyway. Um, I wanted some anyway, so it worked out really well for me. And I had to trade all the rest of my stuff for this bag. All my stuff. All my necklaces and my earrings and all that, but I wanted this bag. 
look how stinking cute this bag is. It's by Penny Sue, and this is my second bag by Penny Sue. And it is the Milan Shoulder Bag in Lilac. And I absolutely love this bag. And that's the back. And I didn't even take the stuffing out of it because I've been waiting to show you. And it's got the leopard print inside. I don't know if you can see that. For a smaller bag, it's pretty roomy. $79 is the retail price on this. Um, so you've got an inside little pocket here. And then you've got the um, like cell phone-y kind of pockets in the back. And it's pretty deep. You know, I mean, your my arm goes in pretty far. And then it's got a zipper on the front. And it's got the same print inside. And a pouch in the front. Lots of little pockets for all the things that you may want or need. So, oh, and it's got this cute little lock here. Isn't that adorable? I don't know. Just these little details I just think are awesome. So, super, super happy with this bag. Now I cannot wait to carry it. I was waiting to show you before I carried it. This is the... Um, the bag that I really, really wanted, and I'm so happy that I got it, even though I had to trade almost my first firstborn child to get this bag. All right, so that is what I got from Little Black Bag. So overall, I'll put my retail value of everything there, um, uh, what I paid and what I got, and I'm super happy with everything. Um, I'm usually happy with everything I get from Little Black Bag. Um, I do have a trading video coming up within the next week. Um, if you have questions about how I trade, um, and how I get the most out of my money. I do have a video that's already up if you really want to see something now I will link that down below. It's 10 tips in less than 10 minutes on how to trim a little black bag um, And again, I have another video coming out in the next week um, Which is a part two to that of things that I've learned since then So I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you hit the thumbs up button down below and subscribe if you like I'm gonna put a button right there for you to subscribe if you would like to and I will see you in the next video Thanks for watching. Bye